soon to that. Hey guys, what's good? Welcome to my channel and welcome to another vlog. So from the setting, you can see that we're not home, okay? So I'm visiting Cambridge this week. Today I'm stepping out, so I'm going to the city, okay, to see around Cambridge. Um, it's not my first time in Cambridge. Been to Cambridge, just a, I can probably count with my hands. Um, but this time, like, I actually want to, like, explore and... I've explored once. I think I just went to the city centre. But, yeah, but I have, like, different things to do. I think it's getting bright. It's, like, sun coming from here. Let me adjust this. Yeah, so this time I'm doing some activities. So I have, like, a full itinerary. Um, I'm also spending the day with Stanley. So we're just going to a few places here. Um, it's actually, like, a packed itinerary. So this might just be a full day vlog because tomorrow, I don't know if... I would have the flexibility to do anything <laughs> um, just because I have like a lot to do so maybe it could be like a day vlog if I do everything today or we get into tomorrow yeah but I'm literally leaving Cambridge on Saturday so I just have today tomorrow to like try to have some fun in Cambridge yeah so today's itinerary um, we're going to a museum a breakfast place um, we're going to this um, St. Mary's Church and when you get to the top you can like view like the whole city um, we're going to a gelato place uh, I'm just looking at outside and the wind is looking like it's crazy fingers crossed um, what else are we going to they yeah, were also going punting that's like one of like the highlights of the day and it's gonna be like the last activity for the day um, so that's like the Keno on like the river and then you get to like see um, different parts of the city yeah so i will take you guys through okay i'm quite excited because tiktok planned this itinerary for me i don't want to say that tiktok is a great search engine now because i literally just searched for all oh, fun things to do in cambridge and I, like i had people's itinerary like pulled up for me um so that's great so i got all these places from tiktok and i've seen what it looks like and i feel like okay yeah it's something i want to experience um but yeah i want to do my makeup i'm going to do something very light and then just be on my way this is about 10 o'clock trust me we had planned this itinerary to start earlier than this because i mean we're meant to have breakfast are we gonna have breakfast by 12 it's looking like we're gonna have breakfast by 12 today um but anyhow i have my makeup bag here i just carried a few things this is a few for me trust me yeah so i've grabbed enough i'm gonna get ready um i want to watch the remaining episodes of love is blind this season for me is not given I don't like any of the couples i'm not rooting for any of the couples i don't think they have good chemistry at all i won't be surprised if only like one of them or two of them actually gets it past the altar i will not be surprised nobody's giving me chemistry honestly um so it's like, I, I would say it's like my least favorite season so far Stop so really your face that close to the camera. Yeah, so I'm heading out now. Um, today's fit is giving comfort because 
the whole itinerary was planned on foot um comfort over style that is the theme for today so i have a black bodysuit i think i got this from primark my jeans too are from primark the coats that i'm wearing today is from buku and then i have my trusted eh, my trusted oswego stanley and i are wearing matching oswegos today it's so cool like if there's anything you want but like it's the same thing we're both wearing the gray oswegos it doesn't have to be you don't have to say matching <laughs> so let's see what you're wearing Shift. jehovah hi guys i'm excited do you know why i'm excited because i took a day off to spend time active. with me. So I'm wearing a sweatshirt from uh, Next. Was that Next or H&M? Uh, I think it's Next. Okay. And uh, sweatpants from H&M. Adidas Oswegos. Why are you walking with the camera? <laughs> and a windbreaker from Birkin. Yeah. Not not the Birkin bag. This one is the Birkin. <laughs> I'm sure they know. Um, yeah, so we're off. It's drizzling. I think it has stopped actually. But it started raining like heavily and I was so scared. Because I was showing you that it's going to rain till like 12 o'clock. So now we just want to seize this break that we have and then go to the museum. Everything is like a walkable distance from each other. So we planned like to be moving away from home. Um, yeah, so. I'm top of my boss using my top. Don't do that. <laughs> using my topical slick salve. Yeah, we look cute. We look cute. Okay. So let's go. Imagine sun shining, pink clouds in the sky, and everything is right. Imagine stars lighting. Hey guys, so we made it to our first stop. Sorry, it's dark, which is the museum. So we're getting in. I'm not taking a picture. All these bass plates everywhere. Yeah, they look good. Hey guys, so 
I didn't see that. I just walked into a puddle. <laughs> we are done with the museum. We couldn't go to all the rooms in the museum. It's pretty massive. And we're running out of time. So we're going to Fitzbillies for breakfast. Um, it's a rainy day. So the hunting people called us to tell us to come earlier. Because it's going to be raining heavily by 4.30. Yeah. Um, so we're going to have breakfast. Maybe go to one more place. So we can get to the content location by 2 30. yeah it's also not cold it's actually just really really raining the sun shining in clouds in the sky and everything is right imagine stars lighting up the night and the shooting stars so vibrant you have to make a wish and then nothing's ever in your way Shot you made. No, you've never heard of pain because you're just high on life. Every day is Saturday. Life is sweet as birthday cake. Why can't it just stay this way? Like you. Hunting is looking like it's time soon because that yeah, this rain is not getting any better. Um, so where are we going to? We're going to the bar. In the restaurant. Now we're going to the restaurant. Eagle's restaurant. Eagle's restaurant. First I think of a delicate thing and then of a break I'm thinking of habits, yeah, all of the bad bits Wish there was a... Welcome to the Eagle It's a very famous restaurant in Cambridge And... Come on, let's go <laughs> Oh my god The interesting thing about this bar is that The individuals who announced the discovery of the DNA they used to come to eat here Could you imagine that? After discovering the DNA, you can't eat. Oh my god, that's amazing! <laughs> and it's also the home of the famous ceiling graffiti of World War II airmen. So that's the lady I was telling, telling you about. They carried the lady to the ceiling and they drew traces of her body. I'll show you. Let's get them. Oh, good then lord, I'm in trouble, you guys. The eagle. Oh, the eagle, makes sense. <laughs> I'll also show you the table where the DNA guy used to eat. It's table 16. We're almost there. Do you have to pay extra to get a reservation of table 16? No, people are currently eating there, but I'll show you the table. Oh, okay, over there. So it doesn't look new. Francis Creek. This is your third guy, Zero. Okay, nice. Military tags. Military tags, okay. Oh, all the way. Cute. No, I can't really. I can see a hand. That's where the hand was. Oh, sorry. 
Okay, I can see. Uh, wait, is it drawn in red? Yeah, it's drawn in red. Right? In, okay, I can see the leg. I can see the bomb as well. Yeah. All the way down. Boss, what story about the window? The story about the window is there was a fire uh -huh. in the house. Yeah. And a little girl was not able to escape the fire, so she died in there. Uh huh. So they believe that they should always leave the window open. Open. For her spirit to go and come out. Come out. Anytime the window is closed, laid by wind, or someone is taking close to it, they experience it fire. Because she died in the fire. This is crazy. It's a crazy story, but people that were here said it's they true. They have experienced it quite a number of times. Okay. So this is the famous bar, the most famous bar in Cambridge. In Cambridge. Guys, so we're done at Raf Bar. Stanley is a very eagle. good accent. Uh, eagle, rough bar, same no, difference. The eagle. Okay, sorry, the eagle. Stanley is, I'll give you 7 out of 10 for your tour guide. Yeah, 7, you tried. That's, that's, that's credits. Shut up. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you don't watch this vlog, no, for the fact that you're seeing this video, it means that you're watching this vlog. I was trying to tell people to watch your video, but the fact that they're watching the video means that they're already watching it. <laughs> So we just finished shopping and we're heading home right now in our new Tesla. A girl can dream. <laughs> Man, this car is cute. This is, is it fake so you could move it, like move the glass? I don't know. But it looks really good. It's very neat. I like it, like it's so neat. That's one thing I love about so it. Oh, the cameras. Okay. So you can see the, where's the front? Which one is the front? There's no front. What else can you check? Of okay. Well, you need to connect to the internet too, so. uh -huh. Oh, there's Spotify here. Cool. That's why I'm playing music. Right? Then you can just put. Ah! God, I beg. Let me take you to church. Yes. Church is the first thing that you said. Obviously. I should take me. Guys, so I think. From here, we're leaving this mall now. Could you just volume a little bit there? This is like a Tesla showroom. So the, they have like two cars in here. So we just decided to, you know, come in and, you know, check it out. But guys, hmm. This is topping the wish list right now. Like, I'm not crazy about cars, honestly. Stanley's someone that's crazy about cars. Personally, if it takes me from point A to point B, and yeah, it looks black, I'm fine with it, honestly. Um, but yeah, it looks really good, honestly. I like the fact that there's this thing here that charges your phone and... But someone like me who is always leaving the house with battery low here yeah? it's a plus okay so i can just be driving and i'm sure that my phone is being charged at the same time so i get to my venue on time and with my phone charged um yeah so we're leaving now we're going outside again ponting looks like it's cancelled right now i don't even know why i'm giving you guys this angle but ponting looks like it's cancelled right now because of the rain it's not advisable so we want to see if we can reschedule it for another time we've booked a movie to see a movie later today so we're just we're going out you've not booked it it can be booked anytime, all right? Like, it's even better to even do it in the. I have free tickets, so that's not issue. Okay, anytime. So we're gonna watch a movie later today. Um, yeah. Six twenty. Six twenty. I wish I had the same delusion that I do when I was two and didn't think that I could ruin anything at all. I could never fall. I 
wish I had that same conviction Convinced I never need a fixing Yeah, that girl really knew her business Where did she go? Yeah, she Louder, louder. plans for today hey, yeah well we had a good time today despite the rain Fontaine would be tomorrow we've moved it to tomorrow um is, is that the way we're going to yeah. st andrews yeah. okay so we're off to we have a movie to see by six but for now we're going to find somewhere to eat and I need to rest because man, we've been standing, we've been walking and I need that. Hey guys, what's good? So we're currently at Chi Street Food. That's the name of the place. It's at the Grafton. It's like you call this place like Grafton Center. Okay, so like the Grafton Center. So we're gonna see a movie um, by six. So we're trying to eat before we see the movie. So we actually came here to go to an Italian restaurant, but it's like it's always like nice dining kind of vibe and. Yeah, I'm not into that. I want to eat burger and fries, so I decided to decide to come here. Um, it's like Chinese and Korean food, so we're getting burger and fries, and then Stanley has this Chinese rice, Korean rice actually. Um, yeah, so that's what we have to do. I'm I'm exhausted when I'm talking because Stanley made me walk. I'm just saying Stanley, 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 so I cannot be blaming you. Feels good to just be blaming you. Um, so I've, we've been walking and then the rain, you know, the rain, the wind, all of that, yeah, kind of just, you know, messed up the plans for today, but I still had a very good time today. Yep. So let us eat our food. I love my wig so much. It looks so good. And if you guys want the details, um, actually the video of this week goes live today by five o'clock. So it would have gone up by the time you're seeing this vlog. So I'm going to leave a link for you guys to check it out. Love the unit so much. It's just what you need for like a day out, honestly. You've got no worries with this one. So we have the Korean wings and then we have the seasoned fries. I wish I had the same delusion that I do when I was two and didn't think that I could do it. Okay, we've got the burger all, and I then never fall. I wish that I had the same good. conviction. Convinced I never need a fixing. Yeah, that girl really knew her business. What was an email with Where did she go? just anything something I've got? Guys, it pays to go out and vlog. And when people ask you, are you a YouTuber? Say yes. Okay, say yes. Say yes. Confident she's number one. And if not, then everybody's wrong. Used to be calm. Now I can remember how I used Where's to do name? it. That I was a member of Confidence Club. Cause that don't last forever. I wish I saw what she saw. I wish I knew what she knew. I love how she just stoned the bus at the Hey guys, what's good? So today is day two in Cambridge. Uh, we didn't finish all activities yesterday, so today we are continuing. The Pontine got completely cancelled. Um, they said because the rain yesterday was quite heavy, the 
tides are a bit high so it's not advisable me say if i will not even like it's fucking no good book outside that big um so we're not doing that today so we're just going out to jack's gelato the weather today started off really well that's even why i had the ginger to come out today again but <laughs> now it's gloomy like it started raining although it has stopped but i don't think the sun is going to come back out but yeah you never really know honestly so we're off to jack's gelato maybe one or two places i'll let you guys know how it goes and yeah just to have like this is like afternoon time to like afternoon evening why is this thing coming out yeah that's what we're doing okay so i have this dress it's like a full dress okay really down to the floor it's from skims absolutely love it i have the same jacket from yesterday same bag same shoes everything from yesterday switched up my wig just because that other week i needed my hair mousse to define the curls and i didn't have my hair mousse so i just decided to you know pull up this one this one is from uni's hair i have the video already on this channel so you want to check it out okay um yeah my earrings i got it from a nigerian brand madon collective i'm very sure i never get the pronunciation very right because it's like a conquerable word yeah so that's where i got it from um i miss out anything i have like rings going on my rings are from zeta jewelry i think one two three from zeta jewelry this one i can't really remember i think i got it from a brand um i'm trying to remember the name but if i do i'll put it up on the screen and yeah that's pretty much it so let's go have a fun day out again yeah for today and pretty much my activities in cambridge because i'm heading back tomorrow but it was pretty nice um it's very different from life in manchester i would say like life in manchester is a lot more bubbly more modern even like the buildings as well in manchester they're quite modern especially at the city center but like here you still have that old english vibe yeah and i think here you also get to like see a lot of people from different parts of the world like a lot of people from different parts of the world because like here you're literally strolling and then you're hearing like languages that you're not familiar with like i've had i had people a group a group of people speaking french i had something that sounded like german today um and of course you have like chinese people and um, like literally everywhere but it's a very nice city i would say if you like like social life like having fun <laughs> might not be so easy here um only if you have like your circle here then you can have fun and then visit like a lot of places here because there are a lot of restaurants here honestly um yeah it was really good um, i'm about to try out what we got from the aromi place 
I had to put it in the microwave. I don't know if it's hot enough. This thing didn't do anything. It's not hot at all. Let me put it back in. Um, it's gonna be hard to talk like with this thing. Anyways, I just know I don't think it's as loud. But yeah, it was really really good. Um, I stopped by John Lewis. We're actually while away time to wait for the bus, but I stopped by John Lewis to get um just to check out foundation. So one thing about me, I'm like always looking for like foundation. Um, and I'm not someone that would just oh I see a foundation online, people are talking about it, and bam, I just open my wallet and buy it, you know. Um, I like to take my time, so I like that here I have the privilege of going into stores to try out the products, um, test it, they do like a skin match for me. Um, so I take note of my skin match, I also let them like put it on my face, so currently I have the foundation. Thank you very much. I have the foundation from Charlotte Tillsbury. This is their full coverage foundation. Um, I've had good things about it, so I just had to try it for myself. So I let them put it on my skin and then, you know, see how my skin, like, takes it. Like, is it good? Am I getting oily easily? Is it cakey after a while? Does it oxidize? Because that's important when picking your shade. Um, so far, so good. I like the shade match. Um, I like that I kind of have this... Um, let me turn off this microwave girl. yeah i like the shade match i like the fact that i have like this kind of like a natural glow with it in a way um the coverage is not all that for me but i think it's beautiful because here they don't use like heavy layers of like foundation so they kind of just tend to keep it very light and i think that's what she did when she was putting it on my skin so this is like a light layer so i think if i use it the way i use foundation a lot more I, I use a lot more products when using foundation. I think it's going to have like very, very good coverage. So I like the skin match. So I take note of it. Also, sometimes getting it in a store, you might not be getting the best deals, okay? So like a brand like Charlotte Tillsbury, they are available in, I think in, is this Selfridges? Is it Selfridges? I think they are available in Selfridges as well. And yeah, I think Selfridges and I think they yeah, they have like a, sh a store in London and they are like available online So you can go online and then compare prices so you can actually end up getting like a better deal Shopping hack from me to you guys don't just see it in store and then just jump at it Check online and see if you can get like better deals online so you could have like vouchers to use or there are times where they're doing sale. So when you have the opportunity to shop at a discount, you already know your shade because you've gone into store and then you've tried it on. Okay, so currently I am wearing 12.5 um, neutral. Is this neutral? Yeah, 12.5 neutral. Um, yeah, so I think, let me bring this thing out and check if it's hot enough. Yeah, it's hot enough. I need it to be hot because there's cheese inside this. So I got the Koto Focaccia. Mm -mm. I ordered it. That's not the product. So it has ham, um, tomato. Let me see. Let me just read out what was written. I took a picture of it. Ham, mozzarella cheese, tomato sauce, and Sicilian oregano. So it's an Italian restaurant that we stopped at, and they just have like pastries and then like pizza slices and this thing. Okay. So I'm gonna have a huge bite. See you guys. You see the cheese and the ham inside. Mm. Yeah, this is actually so good. I love the way the cheese tastes. Like, I actually really like cheese. Man, this is actually so good. All right, guys. So that brings me to the end of this vlog. I do hope you guys enjoyed it. It's me exploring Cambridge. I think it's a city that I would come back to visit another time, maybe during the summer. Cause yeah, going out. Till I think I'm gonna be indoor till summer is ready to summer. At least the weather is ready to agree with me. Not that I'm still seeing rain almost every other day. It's still raining. It's still very cold. Otisumi, I'm tired. Okay, so I'm just going to spend a good next few weeks indoor. Hopefully by April, April, May. We should know what we're doing with this weather. Till then. I'm gonna be inside, okay? So I hope you guys enjoyed this video of my time in Cambridge. I will see you guys when I'm back in Manchester and that would be in another video. Bye.